Hey, I just want to show you the lift I made. It's a part of this is part of the tutorials on how to make a lift. Basically, all it is is a door, a giant door which goes up and down. So look, if we click on the properties of this, it starts open, which means it starts down, so the player can get on it and then press the button and it'll go up. It's toggle, which means it can go up and down, not just up. And the settings we need to set um delay before reset and that needs to be minus one. The lip needs to be five, yeah, great. Um yeah, and that's about it. Lay before reset minus one, lip five, stay open, toggle. Make sure when, because when you make doors and stuff, it touch opens will be there. So just untick that. We're not ticking any of them. Just toggle and starts open. So I can click apply, and then close that screen. And I just want to show you the top. The reason why it's up at the moment is because when the player when the level starts it will go down. Which because of the start open thing. These are little doors which I'll explain later, so I'll get rid of them. Um there's a button here. Which on the output thing is when it's pressed, as you can see on pressed, target named and en target entity's name, which is the lift. The thing we just on via this input toggle toggle means open close that's it and the flags for the button don't move has to be selected and use activates has to be selected and the parent which means the button will move with the lift so you have to type in lift here like that okay so we'll just yeah, we'll just click apply and close this screen. Next is the walls around it. This is just a funk brush, which I made up of three different walls, which is really easy. And what you need to do is make the parent lift so it moves with the lift. Then click apply. So what we have is the door, funk door, here as you see here, flags, it starts open, toggle. That these things don't don't um, matter because that's for the little doors on the thing, so we don't have to worry about that. And the delay before reset is minus one. The lip is five inches. And and oh yeah, if you're making a lift like this, the floor on the upper floor has to be made up of four different parts, so you can make it a little square. See, and that's really easy to do if you know like how to use brushes and stuff the walls are remember, remember to set the walls as funk brush and to make something an entity you would press you select the brush and do control T and then go through and find funk underscore brush and the parent all we have to do for this is add the parent lift ok and then click apply and for, a bu for the button the parent is lift also the output is on press, the lift toggles, which means up and down. And just remember to make sure the door starts open, because otherwise the player won't be able to get on it, as it will start on the top floor, which will be stupid. Yeah, and that's a short tutorial on how to do that, so just remember those settings. Go through the video again, and this, vi this video is available for download from Farfront. Just message me if you want it. Okay. That's it.